Hello friends, welcome back. Today we'll start chapter seven, Earth Science. Introducing Earth's resources and the topic is minerals. So friends, do you know what is mineral? Minerals are another Earth's natural resources. They are always solid and have crystal structure. You know friends, minerals are inorganic. Inorganic means they are made up of non-living particles. Here you can see few pics of minerals. Friends, do you know the study of minerals is called as mineralogy? Okay, so let's go ahead. Now, one question is there, how do we get minerals? Okay, so let's see. We get minerals from the rocks. You know friends, there are more than 4,000 different types of minerals available. And the quartz is the most common mineral that exists naturally on the earth. And there are different types of minerals. Few are like copper, iron, and diamond. Okay, now, you know, the person who studies mineralogy are mineralogists. Okay, so here in picture, you can see some, like uh, some quartz is there. You can see in third picture, these are coins which are made up of copper. In fourth picture, it's like a big rock of iron. Okay, and the fifth picture is shows the diamond. Now, how do we use minerals? Yes, minerals are very useful to the people. People use minerals to make furniture, like the table, which is made up of iron, okay? Chairs, iron chairs, bed, and lots of other things, okay? Jewelry, jewelry, jewelry we use like diamond, and lots of other minerals we can use. Coins, you know friends, coins are made up of copper, antiques, and lots of other useful things. Here in picture, you can see some jewelry. There is a coin, there's one antique pot, that is an antique chair, and an iron, big almara. Okay, now there is one fun fact for you guys. Do you know? Mineral crystals are so small that they can only be viewed under microscope. Okay, now let's see further. There are some more fun facts for you guys. The size of the mineral crystals depends on the rate at which magma cools down. Okay, when it cools at a slow rate, large crystals are produced. You know friends, when the magma cools slowly, okay, so the crystals that form are bigger ones, okay, but when it cools at higher rate, it means when it cools faster, then the crystals that are formed are small sized crystals. Here you can see, here are two different crystals. One is smaller and another one is bigger. So friends, I hope you enjoyed this video. So if you like it, please share it and subscribe it. Thanks for watching friends.